All right, let's take a look at Matthew chapter 6, verse 1. Take heed that ye do not your alms before men, as to be seen by them. Otherwise, ye have no reward of your Father which is in heaven. All right, so in case you have a question of what is alms, let's look at the definition. Alms, anything given gratuitously to relieve the poor as money, food, or clothing, otherwise called charity. All right, and so let's read this again. Take heed that ye do not your alms before men to be seen of them, otherwise ye have no reward of your Father which is in heaven. All right, now let's examine this a little closer here. See what other people say. All right, let's do it this way. Take heed that you do not your alms in front of other people. So the ESV says, beware of practicing your righteousness. That's odd. All right. And then uh, here's the King James. True word of God. Right. And then let's take a look here. The NASB. Take care not to practice your righteousness. It's odd. NIV, be careful not to practice your righteousness in front of others. That is very, very odd, is it not? And in other words, uh, don't practice righteousness in front of others. If you see somebody, just bop them in the beak. You don't want your righteousness to be seen at all by anybody. All right. And then uh, it's interesting here also uh, in the not King James Version or New King James Version. Notice here, it says, take heed that you do not do your charitable deeds before men. I thought the New King James Version was just the King James Version without the these and the thous. Huh? Isn't that what, haven't you heard somebody say that? They just took out the these and the thous. No, that's not the case at all, is it? They completely change the text and almost every verse. It's uh, not a New King James Version at all. It's a trick of the devil to get you away from the true Word of God, which is the King James Version. That's the only purpose for the New King James, is to get you away from the King James Bible. 